coming off deployment, it's a lot of things that maybe you don't realize you're gonna face. One of those things is the amount of responsibility that seems to be there in an overwhelming majority of things that you have to face. Seems like everywhere you look, there's something else that now you are responsible for. In the military, they're responsible for your job and, and you know for your men or, or for whatever you're supposed to do. Well, basic stuff like, like housing and food and clothing, transportation, all that stuff, you never have to think about that hardly unless you're in that department that provides that. All of that stuff is taken care of for you. When you get out of the military, off deployment after being gone for a while, for extended period come back and now all of a sudden is the tag up to date is the insurance lapsed if you have a wife and a family oh who are you again you have to introduce yourself again uh, hopefully not but there's there's things you have to learn all over again you have to find out what's important again you have to re-engage you just don't know what to do man it's like everywhere you look it's like bam you're hitting the face with dick hitting the face with that man i gotta get out of here i need a drink so you get away for a while and you drink drink a lot I drank for seven years when I got off deployment. I needed it. Everybody else needed it too, probably. I guess, I don't know. <laughs> but, uh, you just feel overwhelmed. You just feel like, man, I gotta do all this stuff now. And then of course, you know, I'm military, so I gotta do it right. I gotta, I gotta look good. And there's, there's certain pressure that you wanna be right or appear to be right. You know, so it's a little overwhelming at first get off deployment. Let's tap on that. Even though, even though I have these feelings of being overwhelmed because all the responsibilities that are suddenly mine, except where I am right now and I'm safe. Even though I have all these overwhelming responsibilities that are suddenly mine, except where I am right now and I'm safe. Even though I have all these responsibilities, yeah, they're mine, except where I am right now and I'm so overwhelmed. Oh, it just feels so overwhelming. Overwhelming, it's just overwhelmed. Overwhelmed, all the stuff just stacks up. It never seems to stop. Oh, I'll never stop. I'll never stop. <laughs> they say it stops. <laughs> I could let this feeling go. I don't have to feel overwhelmed. I could handle it. We could do this. We could do this, yeah. I can let this feeling of overwhelm go. Yeah, we can, we can, we got this. We got this. We got this. Yeah, we got this. We got, I can let this feeling go. And you just let it go. Now, if you come back and you look and say, oh, well, oh, yeah, I still feel like uh, you look around and you look at all the things you're responsible for and you say, like, mm, you may get halfway through and say, oh, well, I still feel a little overwhelmed. Tap it again. Even though I still feel a little overwhelmed, concerning everything that is stacked up. I still feel a little. Yeah, I still feel a little. Tap it on down. I still feel a little. Oh, I still feel a little. But I'm going to let the feeling go of being overwhelmed. You know, now you're in a great position to make a great choice concerning what needs to be done. I'm Chaplain Joe. Prepare to live.